Hi everyone, Jen here with Jack's Beanstalks and today I'm going to show you how to make this cute little mini 3x4 envelope accordion album. I'm going to take this off and show you real quick. Okay, so let's get started making our envelope album. Today what I'm going to use is Design Cuts with the View, the Honey Chic stack, and um, I've cut my 12 by 12 down to 6 by 6. And here's one of the papers from there that we're going to make into our mini uh, 3 by 4 envelope. And so I am going to use the envelope punch board to do this, and these are just one-sided papers, so it's easy to do um, if you flip it over onto the back side and we're going to line it up on the 2 and 5 eighths line. And just score. I'm going to make sure that my words are the way that I want them. It's this way. Come in and fold in your side flaps, and then the back side of that punch board. I like rounding the top of my envelope. Okay. And I'm going to use the Xyron high tack tape, and it's the quarter inch. And I'm just going to come in and let me double check which way. Yep. And it works perfect on these envelopes uh, for the closure of them because it stays in place and the envelope doesn't pop open on you. Okay, bring up our bottom and there's our envelope. I've already done two others um, from that Design Cuts with a View stack. And now we're going to attach them all together using the same tape from Xyron, the high tack quarter inch. I'm just going to go along the edge of the flap of the envelope. What we do is we line up our very next envelope so that the flap's on the top. You can flip it over at that point and you can see it on the back. And our last one. I like this high tack tape, it's very easy to just rip off with your finger. You don't need scissors, or unless you need a really clean edge, you really don't need scissors. You can just tear it right off. Line up our next envelope. It's an even. Just down. And that's what we're going to look like. And then we're going to fold it all up. And now it's time to decorate. Okay, what I've done is I have stamped sentiments onto three die cuts. And I've used the sentiments from the Imagine set at Crafter's Companion. And this is actually one of the containers that you can get for your easy mount stamp sets and it holds four stamp sets nicely. So now we just need to attach our sentiments to our little cards that are going to slip into our envelope accordion album. 
and I'm just going to use <clears throat> Cape Runner. And I've also wanted to point out that these bright, vibrant colors are all the Radiant Neons. And it's electric purple, electric blue, and electric pink that I've used. Just going to use my Mega Runner from Xyron. I'm going to put a little bit of adhesive on the back of these die cuts and just center them onto my pre-cut cardstock that was just leftover pieces from when I made the envelopes. Okay, after you get all your sentiments stuck down onto your cards, you just want to slip your cards inside the little envelope accordion album. And we're just going to zigzag it back and forth closed. This is going to be our front and this is our back with the flap. And so what I've done is I've used some really reasonable ribbon. This is organza and it's turquoise organza and I have made a loop and already tied it down and we're just going to slip it on real easy over the edge of our envelopes envelope album and it just slips on and off real easy and we're going to tie a bow that is going to be permanent on the front of here so what I'm going to use is the bow at all and this is the original bow at all they also have come out with a bow doll 2.0 I believe is what it is so I'm just going to show you on the original um, how to tie a multi-looped bow and I'm using again the organza from really reasonable ribbon I'm gonna have three loops in the back actually loops in the back and then a couple in the front and then we're going to fold our back ribbon in half and all the way under and pull it through and tie and as I tie it I want to rock it back and forth so it really locks the ribbon down and in place it nice and tight. Make sure our front looks good. A couple more tugs on that and pull it off and we've got our ribbon. All right here is our finished little mini envelope album and our bow is already tied onto the front and comes around the back to hold everything together and it just easily slips right off and you can open up your envelope album, accordion, there's the front and back, slip out your little messages, and there you have it. Thank you so much for joining me today. Again, this is Jen with Jack's Beanstalks, and I'll help you subscribe to my channel here at Jack's Beanstalks, or visit me over at my blog www.jacksbeanstocks.blogspot.com. I have many more projects coming up and fun videos. Have a great day. Thanks everyone. Bye.